Hello boys and girls. Today we are on day 8 on our 10 days of prayer. And the topic is thank you. Let us pray. Dear Jesus, thank you for today. Thank you for your love, your mercies towards us. Be with us now as we read your words. In Jesus' name, Amen. The story is about Mary that we are going to be talking about. But before, let us go to our scripture reading, which is from Hebrews 12, 28. So let us be thankful because we have a kingdom that cannot be shaken. We should worship God in a way that pleases him. Mary was looking for a wonderful way to say thank you to Jesus. She had made lots of mistakes in her life and other people had treated her badly. But Jesus was always kind to her and he loved him and she loved him so much too. Mary enjoyed the times when Jesus came to her home and taught about God's amazing love. For each person, no matter what they had done or not done, he let her sit at his feet and learn because he wanted women to know that they could be his disciples too. When her brother Lazarus died, Mary was heartbroken. She was so disappointed that she hadn't come to heal him. But Jesus had a better plan and raised him back to life. That was the most amazing gift ever. How could she ever say thank you to Jesus for that amazing gift? She wondered what to do. Then she found a bottle of expensive perfume and poured it all over Jesus' feet at a dinner party. The guests didn't understand what she was doing, but Jesus knew what she was saying. Thank you is the best way she could. He said that her thank you gift was so special, it would be remembered forever. Boys and girls, we too can say thank you to God in all kinds of ways because every time we say thank you to God or to anyone else, it reminds us how blessed we are and it makes happy her too. So I want us to know that when we say thank you, it will make other people happy. So today, I want you to take time out to say thank you to Jesus. Thank you to your parents and everyone who have done something for you. Let us pray. Father, we try in heaven. I just want to thank you for all that you have done for us. Thank you for loving us. Thank you for dying for us. Thank you for reminding us that it's important for us to say thank you. So we pause to say thank you for our lives. Bless us all and keep us, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay, boys and girls, see you on day nine. She wondered what to do. Then she found a bottle of expensive perfume and poured it all over Jesus' feet at a dinner party. The guests didn't understand what she was doing, but Jesus knew what she was saying. Thank you is the best way she could. He said that her thank you gift was so special, it would be remembered forever. Boys and girls, we too can say thank you to God in all kinds of ways. Because every time we say thank you to God or to anyone else, it reminds us how blessed we are and it makes happy her too. So I want us to know that when we say thank you, it will make other people happy. So today, I want you to take time out to say thank you to Jesus. Thank you to your parents and everyone who have done something for you. Let us pray. Father, we try it in heaven. I just want to thank you for all that you have done for us. Thank you for loving us. Thank you for dying for us. Thank you for reminding us that it's important for us to say thank you. So we pause to say thank you for our lives. 
Bless us all and keep us, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay, boys and girls, see you on day nine.